So I did some stuff off camera. Hello, Kinder, and we are back. And uh, if it wasn't evident, we are not where we left off. So the intro was was not incorrect. And uh, if if you want to take a look at my party, you will realize things have changed a little bit. So uh, what happened was, after I filmed the last episode, like I said, I've been an idiot, and I film an episode, and then I record, or not record, I edit the entire thing, then and there, before I even start the next episode. So what had happened was, I filmed the last episode, and then my brother was like, hey, you trying to get dinner? So we went to get dinner, and he said, bring your Switch. So I brought my Switch, and I don't think I have it on me, actually, let's run in here. You will see he decided he wanted to try and trade me some stuff, because I am severely behind, because I've been trying to edit these. So, I have a Farfetch now, and then this little dude he gave me, isn't that Rufflet? I, I'm an idiot, isn't that Rufflet? That do be Rufflet, okay. So we got ourselves a Rufflet, we got ourselves a little Rog and Rolla, and then we have ourselves a little Inke. Inke and Rog and Rolla, I caught myself, but these are because my brother convinced me to do some raids while we were sitting at dinner, and I could not record them. So, my apologies. But that is the reason there is a disparity. Also, you can see I'd be looking fly right now because I changed my pants and I changed my shirt. And if we run over here, you will see I wasted a ton of money. Uh, yeah, we're at 17000 I was over 30000 before. We wasted a ton of money uh, buying a new outfit so that next time I go into a gym or what have you, I'm looking fly. So I feel like I'm looking dapper as all get out. I don't even remember where we left off. But, uh, yeah. Oh, and here, let me introduce you to the Pokemon we have. So, Thicky, you know. Kandorian, you know. Holovision, you know. Noble, my brother gave me. It was a little rufflet that he caught in a raid. I didn't know that raids were a thing. So, actually, we might want to do a raid first before we get any forward. Rock and Roll is just a little, little dude that I caught. I named him Grumpy because my brother's roommate was there, too. And he was a little grumpy that we were playing. And then we have Inke that, uh, Ashton and Fareed convinced me to call Inge. So, actually, yeah, before we head out, I actually want to show you guys, because I didn't know it was a thing before, what the raids look like. So, if you've ever done Pokemon Go, you should have an idea of what the raids are. It's basically like you take a couple of people, um, in this case, you can have up to four people. So, you see those bright red, I want to see if there's any pink ones. There aren't any pink ones, but these are bright red, I haven't done any over here, so we'll start over here. The bright red beams that just go into the sky, that indicate... A little den that looks like this. And inside, you're able to fight a, uh, a little Pokemon. And they're special, and they are absolutely giant. Um, you also have ones like this that I want to see if I can run up to that can attack. Oh, I forgot it's all rainy here. So if you run up to this one, you'll see it'll give you Watts, which are like the currency in this area. Um, that one didn't have a Pokemon. I'm going to try and run away from all these. And we're going to run over towards this one. Alright, you see the light coming out from the sky. You walk up towards it. And then you just go click on it. And it'll give you some watts or whatever. So this is a ghost type. Uh, do I want to do it with Thwacky? Let's switch. Something's telling me my dude Kandorian. Or my, my, my lady Kandorian can do this one. That should be good. How do I start? Oh, there we go. Don't invite others. And it'll automatically put you with, like, three bots to try and help you. And this, to me, is the dopest cutscene. You just have this giant dude that's out here fixing to kill you. And you gotta try and whoop him. But more importantly, yeah, those things take effect. Let's see it, let's see it. Yes! You can Dynamax. So when you Dynamax, you just become a giant. Y'all ready for this? Look at this. Oh. Oh, I love this so much. And you will dwarf absolutely anything in the vicinity. Look at that. If that ain't the most beautiful thing in the world. And now y'all finna just throw hands. Wait, Magikarp can get Hydro Pump? Please do a lot. This doesn't do a lot, I'm kind of screwed. Oh, that... That wasn't great, I'm gonna be honest. 
All right. And then you kind of have to really just hope that you can do enough, because for the most part, these people around you are not that good. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, that wasn't too bad. We, we can live with that. We can live with that. I don't like that. What'd you lower? Defense. Okay, who cares? Thank you, Wobbuffet. Good as always. Okay. And then I just like to spam whatever the most super effective move is. And hope that this little dude can't take it. Look at that. I just, these animations are insane. Like, I know people love to give Nintendo and Game Freak crap. Because they're like, oh, you didn't even do that good of a job animating. But this is just gorgeous. I, I can't fault him for this. Now, why'd you have to go and do that? Alright, let's hope this hits. Mmm, didn't like that. Alright, Brian should probably kill him. Yup, he did. Now look at this. He just goes down a ball of fire. And you get to throw a ball at him. I only have Pokeballs, so let's really hope this catches. But just look at this animation. You turn it into a whole ass beach ball. And just chuck it. <clears throat> yes. 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 Hell yeah, we got him. And then, what my brother thinks is the best part is look at all these rewards you get. So these will help you give help give you uh, experience, which I have yet to use, so we'll use those soon we're out of the battle. And then you get to add the little man to your Pokedex. Now, we're gonna name this little dude... Uh, we're gonna name him Scruffy. Cause he was a little weak and he didn't have the best moves. Um... Nah, we'll send him to the box. I like who I got right now. But that's it. That's how you do a raid. And if I open this up, you do still... Yeah, you do still sustain the damage that you took, but it's really not too bad. And let's head on back to most... Oh, oh goodness. Let's head on back to the city before we move on. Alright, now that we're all healed up, I did want to show you. I have yet to use them, but my brother was telling me all about them. If you use these candies, they will give you experience. And let's just use them all, because I got nothing better to do, and we can do more if we need to. How much? 2,000! Goodness! Screech, no, no, no. We're going to keep that. And then we'll use you as well. 4,000. My goodness! And just like that, we're up to 23. Uh, we also got all these berries and all these cool things. We also got, um, he was telling me about, they have TRs now, so the TMs you can use indefinitely, but these have a number associated with them. And this is just stuff I could sell if I wanted to, but I'm not going to right now. We also picked up earbuds in case I want to control the volume. Uh, yeah. That's how, all, about all we did. Sorry for that stroke I just had there. That's about all we did while I was off camera. Because I didn't want to actually progress the story before we did anything. But, uh, yeah. So, let's move on now. So, if I remember correctly, we just need to run this way. And try and find whatever's next. Who are you, good sir? If your precise Pokemon get injured, don't forget to heal them up with a potion. You need antidotes to fix up poisons. Just remember to stock up on items, and you won't have to visit Pokemon centers so often. I don't know, I like visiting the centers. Oh, is that a Galarian Zigzagoon? Ooh. See, I want it just for the lulls, just because, you know, Hoenn was the first one I ever played on. So here, I'm going to catch it just to have it in my Pokedex. I don't think I'm actually going to add this boy to our team. He survived, so he passed the test. I love the way Obstagoon looks, but I don't know if he's good enough to actually catch a spot on the team. So let's just throw us a ball at him. Speaking of which, we need to pick up more. We gonna get him. 
If this dude runs, I'm just killing him. Good, he wanted to live. <laughs> Hey, Kandorian grew up. Good for you. I get to add you to the Pokedex. Thought to be the oldest form of Zigzagoon, it moves in zigzag zigzags and wreaks havoc upon its surroundings. Nah, I ain't gonna name you. If I name you, I get too attached. Oh no, I don't want to add you to the party. What am I thinking? Send you to the box. That's what I get for just clicking through all this. Alright, sorry other dude. I'm not trying to fight y'all. Ooh, we got a trainer battle. You saw the opening ceremony, right? Then you know why I'm excited to battle. Ma'am, with, with all due respect, Lass Rai, um, I'm about to win this whole, this whole championship, so I don't know that you're trying to throw hands with me. And I'm so cocky, I ain't even gonna switch, even though you got the advantage. Okay, we may have gotten a tad over-leveled doing those raids. Just a hair. J just, you know, just enough to one-shot. I do like this new animation, too, where it shows you all the XP they're all getting. Yay, free money. Ooh, that's the item. I want it. No, 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 no. Three heal balls. Neato. Crap, I didn't mean to do that. Alright, Growlithe. Same rules apply to you. If you can survive the hit, I'll catch you. Who intimidate? I respect it. See, I feel like Growlithe was really overused in Sun and Moon, but I was just never a huge fan. That doesn't count. Just because my man was swinging too hard and with you doesn't mean you get a free pass. Oh, you're gonna survive. All right, a deal's a deal. I'll catch you. This is gonna hurt. Ooh. All right. You survive, I kind of have to. If you jump out of this, though, it's fair game. Okay, we got him. Another dude for the decks. I really don't care too much about filling out the decks, because I know I'll just have to do that later anyway. So, if it seems like I'm kind of just ignoring these new little dudes, it's because I am. Extremely loyal, it will fearlessly bark at any opponent to protect its own trainer from harm. Julio, no, I'm not going to name you, because if I name you, I get attached. I also just don't want an Arcanine. Alright, is that another another individual we're going to have to face? I've been studying foreign languages, computers, and Pokemon. Which foreign language? See, that's something I feel like I never don't get to talk about enough. But I uh, took German for six years. Six or seven? Technically seven, but only really cared about it for six through uh, middle school and high school. So, ich kann auch Deutsch. Oh wait, I did mention that, that's right. That's why my intro is hollow, Kinder. I'm a headass. Sorry, Hannah, you know I had to do it to him. At least we're getting some of our money back. All right, is there anything up here? Leave me alone, Zigzagoon. Trubbish out there crying. What we got here, burn heal? That was a waste. Ooh, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. See, I would love it if one of these encounters I just found a shiny. But, we know that ain't gonna happen. Alright, I already caught your brethren, so even if you survive this, it's not gonna bode well for you, Zigzagoon. Good. You just went down easy. I didn't want to have to do it to him like that. Da -da 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 Let's try and... I'll just fight this little dude. Oh, instead of a Pokemon, I found a trainer. I'll have to check how strong you are. I hate having to rough up these kids. Marvin. Marvin reminds me of my boy, Philip. So I'm gonna call you Philip. Philip, I don't want to have to do this to you. But you're the one who challenged me. Sorry, Badoo. You know I had to do it to him. And he gone. Oh, you have another one I'm gonna have to go keep going against. Alright, let's just rough them both up. Gossiflor. 
I don't know what you are, but I assume double hit will take you out. Just fine. Yep, you're going down. Yeah, if I haven't said it enough, I have tried to avoid everything I could about this game. Even, like, not just the leaks, but, like, official things I haven't been watching, because I just want to be surprised by as much as I can when the game came out. Now, I did get one thing. Um, I don't know if or when I will change. Ooh. I was gonna say, I'm gonna finish this thought before I start talking. I don't know if or when, but I saw the final evolution for Rookity, and I'm really thinking I might want to pick up one of those, because that thing looks sick. Alright, Sonya says, Hey, you gym challenger. You looked a real ace out there during the opening ceremony. I appreciate that, Sonya. That's very kind. Oh, but where's Hop? Uh, I'm gonna tell the truth. I ain't gonna lie. He can't sit still at all, can he? Guess he really wants to catch up with his brother. To his brother. Oh, I know. Let me tell you about something a bit interesting. You see that building over there? It's a company owned by Chairman Rose. This man's Richie Rich. Ooh, is that where the Galarian Weezing are? Just past Route 3, there's a mine where they dig up ore. The building over there processes it. Ain't that neato. Into energy. What kind of ore is it that they turn into energy? In other words, the Chairman is responsible for providing the Gala region with its energy, too. Ain't that something neat. I'm more intrigued why he put the giant Pokeballs on it if it's an energy plant. <laughs> Can't say I really get him, but the chairman seems like a pretty brilliant guy, right? Here, a little something for having a chin wag with me. It's an escape. What is a chin wag? I feel like a boomer every time this stuff happens. Cool, I got an escape rope that I'm never going to use. And I put it in my key item. Oh, it's a key item! Oh, that's interesting. You'll heal up my Pokemon? I appreciate that, Sonya. The way to turf field is pretty long, but that's a kind of challenge in its own right. Good luck, Gym Challenger. I have a name, Sonya. So rude. Alright, let's keep going. What are you? Roly Coley. You look like a Transformer. I. Right. I'm going to give you the same rule. If you live, I'll catch you. That doesn't do anything. You're going to live. Well played, Roly Coley. Smoke screen. Ooh, I like the animation for that. I'm so intrigued. Is that a wheel that it's sitting on? Okay. You ain't getting the heal ball, but I'll still give you a shot. Two. Three. Pony boy got him. You know what? I'll call you Pony Boy. Just because I thought of the outsiders as soon as I saw that. Hey, good job, Thicky. Knock off? Oh hell yeah, I'll teach you knock off. Uh you don't need to scratch anymore. One, two, and ta-da! Ooh, I like that. Roly Coley. He's one one what? Is that a meter, an inch, a foot? Uh, 26.5 pounds. I'm gonna assume that's one foot then? That's tiny. Yeah, I'm gonna call you Pony Boy. I'll give you the capital. Pony Boy. There you go. Sorry, bud, send you to the box too. What is over this way? Is this just another way of going back? I'll, I'll fight you too. Sorry, Missy. Were you thinking of passing through without even looking at my Pokemon? To be honest, that may have been the plan all along. Kayla. Why do you need to spell like Or Kaylee, I think. Purloin. Well, I don't get to try off knockoff on you, but I'm still finna whoop you. Go and give her the old poke. Got him. Ooh, it's a crit, too. Nice. You know, I had to do it to him, Purloin. Hey, Grumpy leveled up. Smackdown? You guys are... I don't need pardon. I do wonder, though, I know in the old games, to evolve Inkay, you had to hold it... Uh, I'll keep fighting. To evolve Inkay, you had to hold it upside down. Because if that's the case, I'm not going to be able to record that. Because my switch has to be docked in order for me to record it. Alright, you get in the branch, too. 
bicycle wheels. <laughs> Hella XP from that. Roar? No, we don't need a roar. You're better off without it. Sorry, Kaylee. I don't know why I'm apologizing. I'm gonna beat everyone in the Gala region. Just you wait. So do I get berries from this? Sure, I'll shake it. Yeah, I'll keep shaking. Can I just shake it, like, forever and just keep getting more and more berries? I'll quit, and I'll just pick up the berries. Neato. Oh, I knocked all the berries off. Whoops. And what do we have here? Beat up. Okay. Never gonna use that, but alright. Ooh, I find- I just now noticed. All those things on the left side of the screen that show all the stuff I've accomplished. Alright, now leave me alone. Wait, oh yeah, wait a minute, Mr. Postman. Postman Tad. Dude, like Tadpole. Oh, that's, oh, that's another thing I forgot about. When I went and saw my brother for dinner, Joseph, is your, Joseph, if you're watching this, shout out to you. The dude, uh, he picked up a Tim Pole, which I'll throw a picture on screen right now if I can. Um, it's a little, like, Tadpole type Pokemon. That he caught and he named it after me. He didn't name it Grant, but he called it Tended. And I thought that was very wholesome. So, now I got Tended and I got Tad. Now we just need to find a pole. What you doing, Missy? If you want to heal up your Pokemon, there's nothing like sitting in camp and cooking up a good meal. Here, you can add this berry to the pot. Cherry berry. Coolio. Why are there, like... Like, is it just me, or are there just too many spots to heal up? Like, I feel like everywhere I go, there's a- Did you make that noise? Sup, little man. Schoolboy Peter. Sizzlipede? What is that? Based on its name alone, I'm gonna assume it's a fire type. So I'm not gonna use a grass thing on it. That was easy. <laughs> that thing is tiny, too. Alright, well, sorry, Peter. Dottler? I don't know what you are, either. Oh, my brother had one of these. Um, Knockoff, I don't know what type you are, either. Apparently, you don't like dark. Sorry, dude, you know I had to do it to him. Hey, good job, Kandorian. Alright. I'm just making bank off of this little expenditure. Alright, let's try and not fight anybody. Super potion. I like that. See, I never use the potions in the game, but if I ever do, I'll use one of them. What are you doing, ma'am? Hiya, me and my little sister have set ourselves up as pop-up Pokemon Center services. Again, why are there, like... Why are there, like, three spots to heal up on the way over here? Like, look, don't get me wrong. You know, it makes it easier, but, like... That's a bit much. Yo! This is cool. It looks like there's Christmas lights all over this place. Oh, that's awesome! Wow! Alright, I'm not gonna catch any of you. Can I pick anything up over here? Oh, star piece. But it's like, is there anything in here I can grab? Just look at that. That is amazing. Wow, I love that. Okay. See, I'd seen stuff in the, uh... In some of the trailers that I was like, oh, that's, you know, that's whatever. I didn't think it would look this cool. Alright, let's battle this dude. You work perfectly. Absolute bet. <laughs> that beard looks drawn on, Keith. Alright, let's whoop this dude's rock and roller. This is just like... Okay, I will say, it doesn't really look like a cave, per se. But it looks like there's just Christmas lights everywhere. Like the little ones that you put around the tree. I love this. I used to always get annoyed when I go into these, because I hate fighting the Zubats. But, uh... This is wonderful. And I get more bank from Keith. Is there anything over here? 
Well, there is some stuff up here. Ooh. What am I fixing to find? I'm just gonna keep running forward. Ooh, what do we got? Rock Blast. That's actually handy. I may use that in the near future. Alright, let's see. Is there anything on the right side? Oh, just an item. I bet we'll take it. Great balls. I need those. We shall take that. I mean, just look at this, though. I was talking smack on the caves earlier. This cave... This cave gets, you know, 5 out of 5 tadpoles. I love the way this place looks. Now, y'all could clean up a little better, but... You know what we ain't judging on that. Ooh. A lady miner. I don't see a lot of those. Georgia. Ain't that wholesome. Timber! Alright. Why? I didn't mean to do that. Um, knockoff ain't gonna work on you. We may as well just give you the branch. Bada bing, bada boom. Ooh, you survived it. And used the move I just got on me. And razor loose should finish you off. There we go. Sorry, my main man. Hey, Grumpy leveled up. Timber, another one. Oh, actually, I probably should have sent Rufflet out. But you know what? That's quite alright. Let's see if Razor Leaf can one shot you this time. It can! Let's go. And come on, Inge. There we go. Proudy. Oh, someone else leveled up on that. How many of these do you have, lady? Georgia, I hate to keep doing this to you guys, but... What are you doing? I'm gonna walk out of here with, like... Not regretting wasting all that money on the clothes. Which I feel like is not a good thing. Ooh, we got something else. Scary face, I like it. Got a scary face. Alright. Ooh, there's something over here I almost missed. Bag of Stardust. See, I know some people like to sell all that stuff for money. I'm not one of those people. I usually just hold on to everything. What's up, Timber? See, I feel like I could make more money just robbing this mine, but, uh... That's immoral and whatnot, so we're not gonna do that. Wait a minute, is that Pokemon riding that? It is! Alright, let's get the stuff from over here. Gotta revive that I don't need. Throw hands with this dude. Because it's unavoidable. Heavy duty boots. These boots prevent the effect of traps set on the battlefield. Hmm. Never seen those before. There's a lot of key items in this game. I'm surprised. Two more super potions. That means she might be tough. Hey, you're that mean lady who was mean to hop. I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> Coming this way, I'd advise against it. Any trainer with a wishing star is in for a beating from me and my Pokemon. Absolute bet, lady. Do it, you won't. You won't. Go ahead, hair flip. You, you're the gym challenger endorsed by the champion, aren't you? What a joke. You're aware that the chairman is more important than the champion, right? I was chosen by the chairman himself, so that makes me more amazing than you. Makes you more cocky. I suppose I should prove beyond a doubt just how pathetic you are and how strong I am. Alright, hand's about to be thrown. Oh, she got a great ball. Bead. Or Betty, I don't know. See, why does she look like she's both 30 and 90? That's what I can't get behind. She has, like, white hair of, like, Betty White. Uh, Solasis. I can take you over the knockoff. Ain't that something. Chairman was wrong, Betty. I'm just giving your Pokemon a little chance to shine, that's all. Bet. Uh, Gothita. Nah, I can take you out too. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Yeah, I'm really starting to think over-leveling may have been a bad idea, because this is a little too easy. Come on, Betty, put up a fight. Hatana. I don't know what that is, but I assume... Oh dear, what have I been doing? Well, whatever, let's just get it over with. 
Or hat now, like a flip note hat now. Oh, that thing's cute. Anticipation. You shuddered because you know I'm gonna whoop you. Knockoffs worked before. Yup, worked again. I like that. That thing was cute. Hey, Thicky leveled up. And Noble. Good job to the both of you. Betty, step off. I see. Well, that's fine. I wasn't really trying that hard anyway. Again, like, you're you're 90 and, and 30 at the same time. Well, that was unexpected. I suppose you're more able than I thought. Naturally, I'll remember your battle style and strategies now. I'm sure to easily defeat you if and when we face again in an official match. Now that we've established that, I won't waste any more time with you. Betty, quit being a meanie. Why is my Joy-Con disconnecting? Okay, there we go. I've already gathered every wishing star in this area. Don't you only need the one, though? There's no real reason for that. Alright, can we just... Can we just all agree that she was a... No need for her to be like that. Like, for real. I thought Betty White was nice. She was just heinous. Let me guess, you're gonna heal my Pokemon, too? Your big sisters is the pop-up center. Yeah, that's that's exactly what I thought. This is just too much. Uh, nearly to a turf field. Ooh, looking like some Karn out here. Jamie. Oh, shoot. That's not a miss. That's a dude. Yeah. What? That looks like a crappy Meowth costume. Is that like a Galarian Meowth? That looks so ugly. <laughs> okay, apparently... What are you, Rock? No, not Rock. What's strong again? I don't know. What type is this thing? HP Restore. Okay, you're gone anyway. Golly, that thing was ugly. <laughs> I'm intrigued, but I like how, uh... I'll use Wing Attack. In the old games, it always used to be, like, everyone but you had only, like, Pokeballs. I like how they actually switch it up and use, like, Heal Balls and Safari Balls and different stuff. That's actually pretty neat. Oh, now that's adorable. Little kid in an Eevee costume. Wooloo, where do you think you're going? Bah. Could it be? <laughs> <laughs> Wooloo crashed and even stopped. What the hell was that? My, are you okay? You took that tackle head on. <laughs> hmm. Oh, you must be one of those gym challengers, right? Oh, I wish I should- I should have lied to him, never mind. Ah, I thought so. I saw you at the opening ceremony. Then why'd you ask? My name is Milo. I'm a grass gym leader, and rather partial to grass type Pokemon. You look more like a Nathan than a Milo, but whatever. I've been itching to see just how good the champion endorsed gym challengers are. Let me find out at the gym stadium. Just head on through this route and you'll run into my stadium. See you there. Come on now, back to the stadium with you too. We can't keep the gym challengers waiting. Bah. I think that was a musical bat. And 30 seconds of black screen later. Oh good, it's Hop. What's up, my man? Look, just just take a look at that, Grant. That's Turfield Stadium down there. Oh, that's the gym. Ooh, I like that. The gym leader just returned, too. Milo's his name. Yeah, I know, Hop. Weren't you paying attention? But the place is jam-packed with challengers. It'll be ages before our turn comes up. Oh, but Sonya was looking for you, Grant. She wanted to ask you about something. She tried asking me, but I had no idea. She's up on that what's-her-face hill. You know the one. What? You don't know the hill? Well, have a look at your map if you're not sure. Bow wow. Oh, Yamper! What's up, my dude? Oh, if it isn't Sonya's Yamper. He's a good boy. The goodest boy. He'll show you on the way. I was actually going to go to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, we're going to go to the Pokemon Center. We're going to heal up just a tad. Oh, I didn't realize Nurse Joy's wearing, uh, like, beige instead of all white. That's a neat feature. Thank you kindly. 
Look here, if I can move a little bit. See how our sleeves look a little different? Threw me off for just a second. Alright, let's go see what Yamper wants. What's up, my little dude? Bow Wark. Who's the toddler? Uh, I'm not reading that till I see who that is. Okay, fine. Thanks, Yamper. Bow. Wow, wow. I had you come because I wanted to hear what you thought. Oh, whoa. Okay. That looks like something I drew when I was five. So that geoglyph, what do you think of it? What? That doesn't look like... I think it looks more like a Dynamax to me. Seems likely. It certainly looks like a gigantic Pokemon. I suppose people 3,000 years ago could have just imagined this, but it looks too similar to Dynamax. Can't just be a coincidence. It could. It most certainly could. A long time ago, a great black storm covered the Galar region. Giant Pokemon ran rampant. But what was that black storm they called the Darkest Day? What connection does it have to Dynamax? Maybe none at all? Guess I'm the lucky lady who will be looking into that. Grand sure gives me a lot to do. Thanks for your thoughts on the matter. As thanks, I'll give you a league card. Why do you just have other people's leagues card? <laughs> Milo's a grass type gym leader. Things will go well for you if you use fire, flying, or bug types. And just because you said that, I'm using only thicky. Take these too. It'll be, it'd be pretty bad if your Pokemon weren't in fighting form. Gucci. Go on then. Get yourself to Turfield Stadium and batter yourself, silly. Bye, Yamper. Bow Wark. Ain't that adorable? What are y'all talking about? You know what I think? I think that Geoglyph was created with the help of Pokemon. Of course it was. How can a Geoglyph from drawn ages ago last for long, for so long without eroding away? That's a whole ass question. It's so perplexing. If I think too much about it, I won't be able to sleep. That's just so weird. Oh, now this is cute. I'm a squirrel. Okay. What are you doing? I want to stick my head into the photo stand when I grow tall. Oh, ain't that cute. Uh, time for the gym. What are you saying? I wanted to know who you were. The treasure lies buried somewhere in Turfield. According to the treasure map, the trick to finding the treasure lies in the standing stones. Seek yourself three standing stones with grass before the other ones. Use well that strength and find then the strength of its strength in the end. Dally not if you have a mind to find what time has left behind. That's what it says, but I can't make heads or tails of it. I'm intrigued. Is this it? This is three stones. Actually, that's five. But you know what? We're going to call it three. Do you have some? Poison. Ooh. All right. So let's head on back. I think now I can fight the gym leader, maybe? Yeah. But with that being said, it's been quite a while for this episode as well, so I think I'm going to call it there for uh, episode 4. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, again, sorry that I had to do a bit of stuff off camera. My brother just told me, more people are coming to the Geoglyph these days. Did you need to walk up to me and say that? Um, <laughs> sorry, my brother was showing me um, a bunch of stuff at dinner, and I got a little carried away. But I hope it, it, you know, it didn't ruin it too much that I did a bit of stuff off camera. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, again, like I said in the last episode, if you have any ideas for names of any of the stuff that I caught, let me know down in the comments because I'm horrible with naming them. Like, Grumpy. That's a stupid name. Um, <laughs> so if you have any better names, let me know in the comments. Uh, but yeah, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Tschüss, Kinder. <laughs> Thank you.